Let the Lion Roar is about the Jewish roots of Christianity and the impact that has had on the church and on the world. And uh, I, I believe the strongest message is that the church needs to remember the importance of our Jewish roots, the, the, the fact that we are grafted in to the Hebrew nation. My entire life has been um, focused on telling the truth about Israel and uh, writing it in a fictional way. You know, I worked for John Wayne, and when I told John Wayne that I uh, wanted to write about the rebirth of Israel as a nation, he said, well, you gotta do it, it's the Jewish Alamo. And so when I heard about this project, I knew that this was something that was exactly parallel to what I have spent my lifetime writing about. This film presents the facts and presents them accurately. We are right now living in a world that is on the brink of a new rise of the most horrific anti-Semitism. It's, I, I would say as a, as a historical novelist, this is very similar to Germany in 1932. And so if you look around, whether it's in America or around the world, when you look at what's going on in the world, the relevance of this film is like no other because it equips anyone who sees it to understand, to comprehend the importance of Israel, the significance of Israel, the truth that God does not lie and his promises are irrevocable. This will change your life. This will empower you. This will give you something that you can take to the world. This will give you a knowledge in a, in a very concise way that you need in, in the world, the way it's going right now. You need to know these things. And once you hear it, you can't unhear it. You can't forget it. This is something that will challenge you, that will change your life forever. People are, are gonna walk away and say, wow, God said, I will bless those who bless Israel. I will curse those who curse Israel. I better get off the fence and start blessing Israel.